Jason, here we are. Uh, it's your second visit now to Warwickshire. You just mentioned there a few years ago, some changes behind you here. It's all yeah, exciting stuff, yeah. isn't it? I mean, uh, other than obviously the, the big building, nothing else has changed really, but it's exciting for, for each best in for Warwickshire, for England cricket to be able to, be able to have a, a stadium, I suppose, as, as good as and, and as, as nice as that. The team's obviously looking to perform this year in all forms of cricket. We're coming up to 2020 time again. It's just exciting times for all cricket really isn't it all cricket fans around the world yeah it just becomes hell to skelter I mean the guys are obviously really excited about the 2020 format I think any player in the world is excited about playing 2020 not just because of the the prize money at the end of it but also you know it's such a fun game and three hours of in and out get your job done and, and you're done and dusted and have you been enjoying sort of your, your recent play? Do you, do you feel you're playing to your potential at the moment or is it still a lot to come from, from yourself? Yeah, I think there's a lot to come. I took a couple of steps back last season just with changing a few action things and, you know, I feel great again. I feel like I'm excited and I feel like the 20-year-old that I want to be when I'm playing cricket. But, uh, no, I'm excited about being back at the Bears and I'm excited about performing for them. And, of course, been playing for New Zealand as well more recently. How's that been going in your, in your own mind? Oh, I mean, personally, I haven't played recently, but, uh, you know, I'd, I'd like to play more games. But be more involved in terms of trying to win more games for New Zealand I think that's that's the biggest thing is as any player you want to win games and you want to win test matches tournament ODI tournaments and and that's the big thing for uh, for every player but uh, that's what I want to get back to and I think I've got a lot more to offer in that sense. We mentioned here just talking earlier about the gap between playing county cricket up to international cricket you've, you've done all that there is a mindset or is it just a, a case of having to have the ability to be able to step up a gear? It's both I think I think it's the ability as well as the mindset just being able to you know disband yourself from the crowd and the excitement of, of international cricket but also be able to put yourself in, in the mode and of facing the best bowlers in the world or bowling to the best batters in the world and also being able to take catches and enforce run outs that shouldn't otherwise happen in a game of cricket but um, you know there is like I said a, stand, a step up in both both aspects of the game and, and physically it's it's just about application I think ment mentally it's about trying to get better. I've seen recent uh, Dan Vittori has been doing pretty well in, uh, in the IPL as well. So more cricket all over the place. I mean, is, is it too much, do you think, or is it just a great time to be involved in the sport? I think it's a great time to be involved. I mean, a lot of players would say that there's a lot of cricket, too much cricket going on. But I, I also think that they're involved in a lot of cricket. They can say no if they if they don't want to play. But you know, I think it's great that there's there's, TV, there's cricket on TV all the time and and all year round. So a lot of players can can sell themselves all, all over the world. And of course, having played on the international scene, when you come to play for a county like this with young players who are aspiring to play international cricket, good to work with them as well and to try and bring them on. Yeah, it is great. It's great to have a bunch of guys who really want to further their cricket and and for that sort of and to see them two years after being here and seeing seeing how much they've improved is exciting for me because you just see guys that want to play cricket and want to play for their country. And just uh, last thing, have you uh, had a go at trying to pop one uh, halfway up the stands yet? No, not yet. I think that's to come this afternoon. But uh, I'm, I'm hoping to be able to get some hitting practice done because I haven't been outside for a while. So it'll be good to, to get some good training done outside. Fantastic. Listen, we'll leave you to it. And uh, thanks for joining us. Yeah, no, not a problem. Thank you. Thank you.